So recently I've been getting a lot of spam calls, like way more than usual. And I'm going to show you guys today how we can block those callers or block anybody really. But for me, I've just been blocking spam calls left and right. So here's my recent call log. I'm going to show you how to do it from here first. Now everything is going to be blurred out because I don't want you seeing these numbers except for this one. This one clearly says spam risk. So we're going to block this caller. Now, how we're going to do that, we're going to hit this little info button here next to the number and it's going to open up the info thing. And here at the bottom of this, there's just an option here just to block the caller. So we'll hit this, we'll hit block contact. And now that number has been blocked. Now, maybe we did that on accident and now we need to unblock it. We can just come here and unblock that number. So that's how we do it from the call log. What we can also do is block people from our messages directly. So I have this uh, text message pulled up staffing. I don't know what this is. This is a number that I probably don't want. So I can either report it as junk. What that's going to do, it's going to delete this message and then report it to I have AT&T. So it's going to report this message to AT&T as well as Apple or what we can do. I'll show you that real quick. So yeah, delete and report the reporting it as junk doesn't block them. So they'll still be able to text you now. But if I click the number and then I go into the info section here, same thing, we can block this caller here. Now, when you block somebody, they may know, right? Like they have an iPhone, their text messages are going to go green. So that's something to keep in mind. Um, and then you also have free apps like Haya and Robokiller that block spam callers. I'll put links to these in the description below because um, I haven't tested them out, but I will to uh, cut down on, on my spam calls. So yeah, guys, that's how we're going to block callers on iPhone. I hope this was helpful. If you could like the video, subscribe to the channel. We'll see you next time.